Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. If you're new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, share this video, and leave a comment down below. Your support helps me make more awesome content for you. Today we're talking about a problem that has plagued many gardeners and farmers alike. How to get rid of armyworms. These are voracious pests that can wreak havoc on your crops and garden plants. But don't worry, dealing with armyworms is totally doable, and I'm here to walk you through it step by step. But first, what are the things you'll need to complete this task? For the full list and where to get them, check the description and pinned comment below. Now that you have all your tools and materials ready, let's get into it. Step 1. Identify the armyworms. Before taking any action, you need to make sure you're dealing with armyworms and not some other insect. Armyworms are usually green, brown, or gray, with stripes along their bodies. They're mostly active during the evening and night. Step 2. Handpick the worms. Put on your gloves, and using a garden trowel, sift through your plants to find and pick off the worms. This method is recommended by entomologists at the University of California Statewide Integrated Pest Management Program for smaller infestations. Step 3. Use insecticidal soap. For small to medium infestations, insecticidal soap can be very effective. Fill your spray bottle with the soap and apply it to the affected areas. The North Carolina State University recommends this method for organic gardening. Step 4. Apply BT powder. Bt, or Bacillus thuringiensis, is a bacterium that acts as a natural insecticide. Sprinkle the Bt powder on the leaves of the plants, making sure to cover both the upper and lower surfaces. According to a study from Cornell University, Bt is highly effective against caterpillars, including armyworms. Step 5. Use spinosad-based insecticides. If the infestation is severe, you might need to bring in the big guns. Use a spinosad-based insecticide in a watering can and apply it generously over the infected area. This insecticide is derived from soil bacteria and is recommended for severe infestations by agricultural scientists at Purdue University. Step 6. Set up yellow sticky traps. Armyworms are attracted to the color yellow. Set up yellow sticky traps around your garden to capture the adult moths and prevent them from laying eggs. Step 7. Apply neem oil as a preventative measure. To ensure that the armyworms don't come back, apply neem oil to your plants as a preventive measure. Neem oil disrupts the life cycle of the armyworms and keeps new ones from taking over your garden. A study published in the Journal of Pest Science confirms its effectiveness. That's it. You should now have a garden that's armyworm free. Remember, consistency is key, so keep an eye out for any new infestations. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to subscribe, share it, and leave a comment down below. See you in the next video.